folks shouting in the middle of the bazaar. They surprised me. How was I supposed to know they had shears? Can you hear yourself at all? Easy for you to say. What can I do for you? Hey, Alberto. This new armor of yours is flimsy. More fit for a beetle than people. Yeah, way too thin. Fierstein! Peter shows a great protection. This is top craftsmanship, made from the finest quality materials. They built from... Ah! Ah! Uh-oh, I can almost see the steam pouring from his ears. Look out, <laughs> he's gonna blow. <laughs> titanium. We reinforce the armor with titanium we pulled from the scrapyard. That's why they're lighter, and better protection. You guys shouldn't be such dicks. Well, why didn't he just say so? We'll see. Thanks, Vincenzo. You didn't have to. It was nothing, Dad. Ah. Uh, as for you, those two oafs took the last titanium vests. I'm not here for armor. Sophie sent me. You're supposed to bring me in on some plan? The plan? My plan? Carl agreed? Carl agreed! You hear that, Vincenzo? Not Carl. Sophie. You gonna share or do I have to guess? Windmill. We take down the windmill. Bingo! The big windmill that provides power to the PK headquarters. <laughs> but first, we need the charges that Jack and Joe left at the water tower. Hm? Would you bring them to us, Pilgrim? After we blow it up, all the UV lamps in the PK headquarters will go out. That'll allow the infected to attack them. Hmm? Old Villador will be free again. And you, you have a clear route to, uh, uh, you know, uh, the past chemical fallout uh, and to, uh, uh, what's it called? The central loop. The central loop, right. How do you know the PK will withdraw and not retaliate? Because Dad designed this windmill. He knows it like the back of his hand. And it's the PK base's only power source. Without it, the PKs won't last another night in Old Villador. But we must act fast before the peacekeepers catch wind of our plans. So, you win? Okay, so the windmill powers all the PK's UV lamps? Yes, it does indeed. A lot of people will die. Only if the PK don't turn tail and head back to where they belong. They stole that windmill from us. It was ours. Lucas and his men, they... When they came, they... Ah! Ah! Damn it! Took, took it. it. Exactly! They took it. Without electricity, Ator can't keep anyone here. We have generators, smaller power sources. They need a large power source. They'll have to withdraw. And before they return with backup from the central loop, we'll block the tunnel ourselves. Their commander, Jack Matt, is not going to risk fighting in the dark with the infected and renegades at his back. Old Villador will be ours again, and you will go to the center. All right, fine. I'll do it. Okay. Go to the water tower. We're going to use the charges that Jack and Joe tried to blow it up with. Let me know once you get there. What are you waiting for? About time so. Oh, Aiden. It's you. It's so good to see you. Oh, it's good to see the two of you still together. It all worked out. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it did. For the most part. It hasn't been easy. The necklace? Well, my mother sold it, but it wasn't worth nearly as much as we'd hoped. But don't get us wrong. Um, things still mostly turned out fine. We'll manage. Yeah. My mother lets Les stay, and we do our best to help with money. <sighs> That's good to hear. Supposed to be discreet. 
Not go shouting in the middle of the bazaar. They surprised me. How was I supposed to know they had to hear? First tournament at all. here pk's they've been searching us for weapons found our molotovs and went ape shit slaughtering everyone in sight looks like someone set us up who and where are the bombs for alberto we managed to send some out the couriers last reported near star square then silence alberto the charges are gone i'm going to the star square that was their last check-in. Oh. Oh, my. Exactly. Ada? Yeah. Be careful. Someone sold us out. Find the, the, the charges. Without them, the plan cannot proceed. Doing what I can. I'll be in touch. Some fight. The PKs ambushed your transport. He searched everyone and everything. Eventually, they found the bomb. Someone tipped them off. And they took everything? Dunno. Suddenly, something scared them off. And what? Where are the charges? Hey! Um, they were in the yard. Come on, maybe I didn't steal all of them. Lucky few of the infected showed up. Everyone scattered, probably leaving the bombs behind. Don't know why they didn't steal them. They were right under their noses. Morons. <laughs> Fucking hell.
Alberto, I have the charges. Wonderful! Excellent! So what are you waiting for? Come back! Here I come. Thomas to you. May his infection weary body find peace in its return to nature, and his soul never suffer another such denigration. Our Lord, we know this loss is part of your plan. We humbly await the arrival of our Savior. And now, now let us pray that Thomas's soul finds its way to glorious redemption. Where's your father? There you are! Only two? The PKs took the rest. Damn, damn it, triple them! Because of that traitor, our plan is in danger! We must act quickly! No, nitrates. We need fertilizer. Then we can make more explosives. The old night runners, they've got everything. And certainly all we'll need to make more bombs. I know a guy lives on a rooftop. Friend, a foe, it depends. Killian, you know him? What, Hakon's friend, Killian? Yes, Killian. I'll explain how to... Uh, how to... Uh, uh, uh. I know the way, thanks. Buy a thousand fireworks! Get a move on, Pilgrim! Did they rough you up? A little. The worst thing was they took all the equipment. You couldn't have screwed it up more than you did. Then why did you do it yourself? Killian! Killian! It's Aiden! You there? Killian! Hack on. 
Back then, everyone must have thought BFFs forever. Bingo. Alberto, I have your fertilizer. It's Vincenzo. Vincenzo? I, I can barely hear you. The PKs, they raided my place. I can't talk. The traitor, he sold us all out. Hayden, Dad, went ahead to the windmill. Meet him there. I'll meet you when I can. Make sure that fertilizer gets to my dad. Okay, I'll do my best. Just come quick. It won't be enough. And They're still after me. I'm pinned down, Hayden. Another patrol. You have to do it without me. Join my dad. I'll be on the radio the whole time. Me and your dad? You think that's a good idea? We have no choice, Hayden. Hurry. Please. if you noticed, but Dad's kind of awkward and unappreciated. This is a chance to show Carl, Sophie, everyone at the bazaar that they were wrong. What Dad's made of, what he can do. He'll be the hero of the bazaar after this one. He always wanted to do something big. That's exactly what I'm afraid of. I'll stay with you on the radio. Hello? Vincenzo? Hello? Vincenzo, I... I can't hear you. What? What do I have to do? I brought the fertilizer. Are you sure you got this? Of course I'm sure. And if I don't know something, I can ask Vincenzo. Ah, the windmill's causing too much interference. The radio doesn't work. Ah. Then I'll figure it out myself. It's as easy as I. And you're certain? He explained everything to me. Relax! We'll do... Me and you will do... <laughs> no reason we won't do just... And Fine. Like I said, easy as pie. The bombs are ready. You're up. Take the charges and secure them to the spots Vincenzo marked for us. Planting bombs. <sighs> What could go wrong? Easy as pie, right? Yes, precisely. Like I said, easy as pie. The bombs are ready. the plan through to the end. Ladies and gentlemen, allow me to introduce Eugene Kirkland, chairman of the Dynamo Cars Electric Car Factory Workers Union. Employees of Dynamo Cars. As you all know, the Council of Mankind issued a decree today allowing military to seize the factory. I'm sure many of you are concerned. It's only natural. Dynamo Cars is our home. It allows us to provide a home for our families. But today's action serves a greater good. A higher purpose. A higher purpose for us all, upon which the very future of mankind depends. 
in a time when darkness has fallen suddenly upon us, we have the power to cast a ray of hope. God willing, with your courage, you will make this your home again as it becomes a solar plant, providing the power that will reshape the city around us. I know what I'm asking of you, but as we think of you continuing to provide you work, you think of how you will serve your neighbors as you adapt to these important changes. It is time to make history. All of humanity is watching us. Let's get to work.
explosives are in place. Time for the fireworks. Would you like the honors? Sure. This should be fun. Mm -hmm. The detonator isn't triggering. Must be interference from the windmill. It doesn't look like that did much. Windmill's still standing. I mean, the rotor's still spinning. Uh, Vincenzo's calculations. They must be off. I'll have it fixed in a flash. Gotta see this through. It's my fault, not Vincenzo's. My fault. What are you doing? An armed bomb? Before the PKs get here. Giving you an armed... Um, uh, armed... Uh, we can't rely on radio detonation. Not with all the interference. What now? This one is guaranteed to blow up the whole windmill. All right, how much time do I have? Let me count. Mm. It'll blow any second! Run! But where am I supposed to put it? Where? You have to go back! A and? And plant it on... Uh, 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 place it on... Put it on... The... Plant it... Plant it where? On the generator? No! Not there! Right in the middle of the windmill? I can finish my own sentences! Thank you very much! On the rota! You have to climb up to the rota! To the very top? You serious? The bomb's ticking, Aiden. You really think we have time for jokes?
Hello? Hey, Alberto? Hey, Doc! Oh, hey, guys! I'm coming! You sons of bitches! What have you done to him? You, the windmill would still be standing. Almost like the fireworks in 90. Uh, 90. Uh, even. Ah, oh, man. I'm old. And you'll just keep getting older. Quit the bullshit, Aiden. I'm not that adult. Thanks for helping me. <laughs> I know what they think of me. Of course I know. <laughs> Tell everyone we pulled this off thanks to Vincenzo. Okay. <laughs> That's thanks to you, Alberto. No. Thanks to Vincenzo, okay? They laugh at him. Laugh because of me. <laughs> but now that we've done this, they won't laugh anymore. See, he's, he's old man's, huh? Not a cook or a, or a failure anymore. Force the peacekeepers to withdraw. Say it was him. Promise me. All right. Okay. Oh, and tell him. Tell him that... That's okay. I'll tell him. That I'm proud. Never told him that. Son, I'm proud of you. I'll tell him for you. I promise. thing I still have to take care of. You don't get it. There's no time to waste. We can make our way to the center now. Everyone's too busy to notice. I promised Alberto I'd tell his son something for him. Do you want to finish your business or play shepherd spreading the good word? Well, it's bad news, Hakan. Alberto is dead. I see. But the metro is empty. There might never be another chance like this. Are you sure? I have to go find Vincenzo, Hakon. I promised. A night fucking errand. Hurry. Remember Sarah and Yana. Find me at their place when you're done. If you're still alive.
who betrayed them. Oh, that a wrap. All cleaned up. Didn't put up much of a fight. Yeah, because they're cowards. Told you before. What about the prisoners? Throw them in the dungeon? Unless you feel like banging them first. Look. It's Chubbs. They killed Chubbs? Looks like it. But only him, I think. We gotta tell Anderson. Yeah, but where is she? Should have been here ages ago. I'll look for her. days.
thought it was over, man. I can't believe Carl betrayed us. Fuck, Pilgrim. At first I thought you gave us up. But Carl... If it wasn't for him, the Peacekeepers wouldn't have attacked. But he fled right after the blast. There are more on the upper level. Okay, I'll go there. You run. Don't be scared. It's safe now. Thank you. Hey, Sophie. So where's Vincenzo? Aiden, watch out! Aiden's gonna pay me hella gold for you! Huh? Shit! <laughs> Guy wasn't even worth a golden shower. Get up, Aiden. Thanks, man. That makes us even. It's not over yet. Aiden! Aiden! Come on, you coward! Ooh. Come down and fight! You better get out of here, Anderson. You're on bizarre turf. Look, tell Aiden there's still time to call this off. Why would he do that? We're winning. You're stupider than I thought. Come down and fight, and stop using your bizarre buddies as human shields. Aiden, no! Didn't like the sound of that. It's off! Get some! You won't escape! Let's see how... Here you go! Aiden? We have reports that Aider's men are retreating. The plan worked. We took out their lights and the infected tore them to pieces. They don't stand a chance without him. Aider withdrew his men. They're in the metro tunnels. We're not getting to the center that way. Carl betrayed us. He's the one who went to the peacekeepers and warned them. Claimed he wanted to prevent bloodshed, but made things worse. But now, I run the bazaar. And I promise, we will defeat Ador. And I will take you to the central loop. Sophie runs the bazaar! For Sophie! <laughs> they know how many PK creeps it takes to screw in a light bulb? None! because they're too dead to screw anything. <laughs> Alberto's dead. <laughs> Don't be a buzzkill, Aiden. Yeah. <laughs> I'm serious. He was killed taking down the windmill. How'd it happen? We put Vincenzo's plan into motion, but then Alberto had to go in his son's place. Sacrificed himself to blow up the windmill. Fuck me. To Alberto! To Alberto! So, where's Vincenzo? He's outside. Look around. Vincenzo. <laughs> we did it, Aiden. My dad, he really did it. Your father wanted me to tell you, um, he's always been proud of you. Very proud. What? 
Why are you telling me this and not him? He died, Vincenzo. Died for the bazaar. Was he in pain when he died? No, he was all smiles because of you and because he was able to carry out your plan. Thanks for being there with him, Aiden. Your dad kicked ass, Vincenzo. Yeah, Alberto's all right. Hell of a craftsman. For a loser, you mean. For a failure. That's what you used to say. If only we had more like Alberto, the PKs would have been gone ages ago. You, go in and check on Vincenzo. Now! You did a frickin' awesome job, Aiden. We'll beat the PK, and we'll help you get to the center. You're one of us now, brother. You're part of the Bizarre family. Thanks, Barney. Good luck. Good luck, Pilgrim. Hey, Hakon. Where are you? I'm waiting for you at the girl's place. You'd better hurry, Aiden. The passage to the center. It's blocked. I have another idea. Just come quickly. Time is not on our side. Okay. I'm coming. Looks like you turned out not to be such a prick after all. Back on. Ah, you're finally here. Let's go. When Yana heard you were coming, she grabbed Sarah and they left. Seems they weren't too fond of you. Hey, where are we uh... at? <laughs> ah, what the fucking hell? <clears throat> ah. Calm down. Just let me see. Let me see. Ah, I'll help. Fuck. Wait. I'll help. Ah. Show me. Relax. You're gonna pull through. What's that? The wound from the Lazarus? You so you killed Lucas. If not for those brass knuckles, it would only took a few seconds to do the job. Ah, I thought it was a better fighter. Ah! The fuck are you saying? Ah, no point denying it with this wound, right? So you carved ah. out his tattoo and planted it on Barney. Ah, Waltz. He ordered the kill. You're working with Waltz and you didn't tell me? You piece of shit. Oh, you don't get it, kid. Waltz would have killed me, you see, like he killed Dylan. And anyone who defies him. I have to get out of here, get it? I couldn't have told you. Why? You know he's the one who tortured me in the past. I didn't tell you in order to protect you. So what if you find out something about, about your sister? Waltz will kill you. Where is he? Ah, fuck. Where is Waltz? It's supposed to meet him under the electric car factory in the GRE tunnel. Hey, then I'm fucking dead here, understand? They're gonna kill me. You'd leave me. You'd leave me now.
I should leave you to die for what you did. Why wouldn't you? I'm gonna find that sniper first. Ah. Really? You do that for me? A life for a life. After that, we're fucking done. Goddamn sniper. No, nothing. Use your binoculars. Shut up. I'm done listening to your sage advice. I know, I fucked up. Let's leave it at that. Those bolts fly far and fast. Find something to hide behind. Tell me something I don't already know, Hakon. 